Welcome to The Boat Show. I'm Bill Hackett. Today we're coming to you from beautiful downtown Palm Beach and we're lucky enough to be at the Wally booth checking out the world premiere for the Wally Power 58X. That's right, this is hull number one debuting in America and it's set up with these quad Mercury 600 horsepower outboard engines and it's ready to go. So when we talk about the performance of this boat, it's all about performance. Carbon fiber, it's super light, so it's gonna fly through the water right around 50 knots. It's gonna cruise at 38, and it's gonna go 320 nautical miles on a tank of fuel. So this 58X is full of innovation, and one of them is the passerelle slash swim ladder. So it can go down into the water, it can slide up and act as a passerelle, but when it's underway, it tucks right in. Luca Pisani has knocked this one out of the park. So when we talk about Wally, we'll talk about an absolute iconic brand with that sailing DNA. But really, this one is an afternoon party to go because the sides fold down. You can get a massive amount of people back here. You can relax in the sun. We also have a sunshade, Bimini that's uh, electrically actuated that comes up. And it really expands the use of space here in the aft end. And it turns it from an amazing performing cruising boat into an afternoon out on the water with a glass maybe of Prosecco or an aperitivo. So there's two versions of this boat. The Wally Power 58, which is inboard, and then this version, the 58X, which is the outboard version. So we gained a little extra space. So the normal storage space right underneath is for your tender garage, maybe a sea bob or stand up paddleboard. But where the engines are, you have extra storage space for all those needs while you're under passage. Luxury comes in many forms. And one of them is the dimension of space incredible amounts of space on this boat, especially with the gull wing doors down. We get a fresh breeze coming in. Overhead, we have protection from the elements. We also have these beautiful LED lights, which change colors. And then we have this curved glass going up forward. It's actually double curved, so you increase your view, great visibility for all your guests, as well as the captain. And as we turn our attention to the cockpit area here, we have a nice dining area, seating for as many guests as you need. And of course, we have a nice little summer kitchen up here so you can cook the pasta. Of course, we have a wet bar over here for that fresh aperitivo, maybe a Negroni, whatever you need out on the water. So there is carbon fiber all over this boat, but the carbon fiber you find right here on this dinette table, it's a little different. It's scratch proof and it's also fingerprint proof. It makes it great. So the use of carbon fiber gives us added strength and it reduces the weight of the boat. And in addition, it looks fantastic. There's carbon fiber all over this boat, from the seats to the accents here, like I said, to the table, even into the hard top. But as we pay attention to the helm area up here, on the starboard side, we have access to the crew quarters. Now, it's not necessarily a dedicated crew quarters, it's a cabin that can be set up as a guest cabin or if you're ready to take on a captain for the weekend, you can privately have them come up here so they have private access without disturbing the rest of the guests. Form follows function all over this beautiful vessel. How about these insane futuristic seats? They're carbon fiber. They look like they're out of a spaceship. But guess what? It's so comfortable. You're ready to take the wheel and take this thing for a spin. So we have the carbon fiber accent dash. We have a twin Simrad display. We have incredible view with this windshield up here. And of course we have our mercury controls for that 2400 horsepower to put that thing down and let this thing rip. So we have our mercury sky hook. We also have a bow thruster on here. And then we have this vented sunroof up here, which is electrically actuated. So as we step down below, first and foremost, it's hot outside. We have air conditioning at the helm and tremendous air conditioning right here below. So 
Here we have that guest cabin I was telling you about. It can double as a crew quarters and it can be set up either way. Nice aft bunk here. Then we have a shared day head for this quarter, the crew, or all your guests. Let's step forward into the main cabin. So the primary suite, we have it all going on right here. First of all, carbon fiber floor. It's actually very cool on your feet because of that air conditioning. Then we have a very generous berth up here. We have a TV, storage everywhere you look. And then we have a full on suite, stand up shower, and it's so well appointed. When it comes to design, Wally is absolutely uncompromising. And where does it show? In the hull. When this thing is running in the water, that high freeboard, this boat is absolutely gorgeous as it runs. And that's because they're uncompromising without putting a porthole in the side. But guess what? We have a virtual porthole or a virtual window to the world so you can see the boat running with style, yet it's practical so if the kids are out on the stand-up paddleboard, you can keep an eye on them while you're below. So up here on the bow, the Wally really comes together. First and foremost, when you look overhead at these boats, you can see the sailing DNA throughout the Wally line. If you want to get some sun while you're up here, come on up with a nice cool drink and relax in the sun. And one of the unique things about the Wally line is the anchoring system because it gets tucked away and it doesn't interfere with the beautiful lines of the Wally. So Wally is known for seamanship and this beast absolutely runs through the water in rough seas and it's going to give you great performance. But the best part about it is that Italian style and that commitment to design. So we have the high bulwarks right here, this terranium blue, which is a nod to that Sardinian sea. It changes with the light. It's absolutely eye popping. Honestly, you need to sea trial this beautiful vessel. So where do we go to do that? You go to Fort Lauderdale, go to the brand new Ferretti facility, and you can get there by boat. They'll pick you up, they have a car service, and they'll bring you into their state-of-the-art facility with indoor slips, take you out in a sea trial, and treat you like gold. Go see it for yourself.